Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hi, Jorge, how are you? Fine, you? I'm good, thank you for asking. How was your day? Thank you. Um, very busy. I was busy. Okay, then. But I don't right now. Okay. Awesome. Yeah, we all have a very busy day, yeah. right? Um, mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, teacher, the last day I have the one no notice. Notice? Mm -hmm. Notice, yeah? Notice? Uh, um, and you? I have a, a, a notice. Yeah? You have a you have a what? I'm sorry. Do you want notice? Oh, okay. And all the, yeah, about yes. my my um uh, plataforma. Y, eh, ellos me dijeron. They say me I I have uh, the last day uh, 17 December for para presentar todo eso. Yes, that's correct. The last day to um, complete the platform is on December 17th before 11.59 p.m. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, eso me dijeron a mí también. Okay. Um, de que tienen hasta el 17 de diciembre, que sería el otro jueves, antes de las 11.59, para que puedan ser tomados en cuenta para el siguiente módulo. Ya. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. No, no, está bien. Okay. Okay. I I will to do tomorrow weekend. Yes. Yes. And if you have any questions, you how can, many? You can how know. many? Okay. No. 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 It's okay right now. How okay. how how many lessons? There um, are. There are five sections. And if I'm not mistaken, each, each one is, let me see. Section one is 16 lessons. Section two is 12 lessons. Section three is 12 lessons wow. plus the midterm exam. Section four is okay. 16 lessons and section five is 15 lessons plus the final exam. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. It's okay. I have the weekend for work. Yes, that's okay. Yeah, the good thing is that you still have a week to to complete the, all the content. Yes. Yeah, yeah, don't don't worry. Mm -hmm. And also, guys, okay. just as a reminder. Yes, you still have the time. That's that's a good thing, right? Um, that you still have one week to go before the platform closes, right? So you're good. Está bien. Es ahorita está bien de tiempo. Yes, you're good. Okay. You're good. All right, guys. So thank you very much I for can joining. Do it. Yes, yes, you can do it. Yes. In any case, if you need any help, um, I'm glad to help you. All right. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, guys. So thank you very much for joining today. How are you guys? How are you? Uh, Astrid, Jose, Arlen, Bessie, Mayoret, Patricia. I'm, I'm great. Awesome. Thank you, Astrid. What about the rest? Are you doing good? Fine. Awesome, Mayra. Thank you. Bye. All right, then, guys. Thank you, Arlen. All right. Okay, then. So, okay, then, in that case, let's start. Do you guys remember um, the class from yesterday? ¿Se recuerdan la clase de ayer? Regular verbs. Regular verbs, right? Perfect. Thank you very much. Regular verbs and it was simple past, right? Simple. That's correct. Okay. Hello, Dave. 
That's correct, regular, uh, regular verbs, right? And as I mentioned, regular verbs, you just need to add ed at the end, right? It can either be for simple past or past participle, right? So today we're gonna continue. This is, this is yesterday. Vamos a poner acá la parte. Yes, today. Right. So today we will cover irregular verbs. All right. Thank you for the panel. Irregular oh. verbs. Also for simple past. All right. So don't be afraid of irregular verbs, guys. It's they're pretty much the same as regular verbs. You just need to because um as the name says, they are irregular. What you need to do is to memorize them, all right? Or, or an idiom for that, one uh, idiomatic expression para memorize, sería learn them by heart. Okay, ese es un idiomatic expression, guys. Para memorizar, is learn them by heart. Mm -hmm. That's correct. Esto es un idiomatic expression, right? Una expresión idiomática. Um, una expresión idiomática en español para eso sería... No se me ocurre ahorita, pero es memorizarse, guys. <laughs> Sorry, ahí les quedó mal en español. But uh, memorize, you can also say learn them by heart. El que es lo que se tienen que memorizar, irregular verbs, all right? Porque ellos solitos tienen su propio pasado, eh, simple y participio, all right? Que es exactamente lo que les acabo de enviar al, al WhatsApp, all right? La lista de verbos irregulares. It's okay if you don't memorize them right now, porque son un montón. So don't worry, no se preocupen, all right? That's the reason why I send you the list. So whenever you have the time, you can start memorize them. And today, we will just start uh, with a couple of them. Solo vamos a iniciar con un par de ellos, no con todos. ¿Sí? So, ¿quién me dice cómo se hacía? Eh, ¿Quién me dice un ejemplo, guys? Who can tell me an example of regular, con los regulares? ¿Cómo se hacía una, una oración simple con un regular verb for the past? ¿Quién se recuerda? Mm -hmm. We have to add ed at the end. Mm -hmm. Can you give me a sentence? Yeah. Uh, for example, um, play, played. Mm -hmm. Play. And played. That's correct. ¿Cómo me harías una oración con ese verbo, Dave? I played yeah. video games every Sunday. Yeah. Awesome. I'm doing every day, but let's say it's Sunday. All right then. So I play. <laughs> Dave says. <laughs> Dave says I play video games every Sunday. That's correct. All right. Dear me. Or I play the guitar. Last yes. Sunday. Perfect. I play the guitar. The last. Mm -hmm. I play the guitar. The last Saturday. Oh, Saturday, sorry. Saturday, perfect. I played the guitar the last Saturday, right? Acuérdense que el pasado simple es el más simple de los pasados, right? You just mentioned the action, right? Y si quieren, mencionen el día en específico, la hora en específico que se pasó, right? So that's both are perfect examples, see? ¿sí? Los ambos son ejemplos perfectos. So it happens the same with the regular verbs, guys. It pasa exactamente lo mismo con los verbos irregulares. Vamos a separar por aquí. So, ¿quién se recuerda de un verbo irregular? Drew. All right, so. Dibujé. Drew, okay, yes. ¿Cómo me lo haría en, um, en oración? En oración, I drew. Mm. 
cualquier cosa, porque de dibujar se puede dibujar cualquier cosa o no. Uh -huh. Yes. Ah, I drew a horse, right? I drew oh, a, a landscape. Herd. Perfect. Yes, a landscape a or drawing. horse, etc. Right? Puede ser, pudo haber dibujado cualquier cosa, right? So I drew a landscape. I drew a horse. I drew etc. Right? Hagamos what, otro is, what is what is landscape? I I know, but I forgot it. Paisaje. <laughs> that is correct. Oh, oh, oh thank you. You're okay. welcome. So that's correct. I drew a landscape, right? Yes, es exactamente como se hace. See? ¿Sí? I drew a landscape. Okay. For example, I bought pupusas yesterday. I bought. Right? Bought, right? And you didn't and you didn't say nothing, right? Yeah, I didn't. <laughs> yeah, I did. yeah. <laughs> it was my dinner. <laughs> it was right. <laughs> so I bought pupusas yesterday, for example. So in this case, uh -huh. because we're talking about the simple past, that's that's the only thing you add, right? Pasado simple, the sentence is a simple sentence, all right? And it happens the same if you wanna if you wanna do it in um, um in a negative form. No, not not yet. No llegamos al el participio todavía. So, okay. digamos, cómo haríamos? Comencemos con los regulares. How would you make the first sentence negative? I I don't play or oh, I didn't play uh -huh. video games. Uh -huh. Video games every Sunday. I did not. Or, uh, yeah, I didn't play. Video games. Mm -hmm. Vamos a poner en otro color, all right, para que se distinga una de la otra. En okay. rojito. Uy, no, porque se cambió todo. Wait, <laughs> eso no era. Calm Estaba down, planeado calm down. Así. <laughs> All right, vamos a cortar eso. Don't get nervous. Yes, you, all of you guys make me nervous. All right, so, <laughs> esta. And <laughs> esta, porque no se vea tan feo. All right. Cool. Uh, So I didn't or did not, como ustedes se sientan más cómodos, ¿sí? Play video games. How would you make, uh, how would you make, I'm sorry, negative, the second sentence? I did not or didn't, como ustedes gusten, right? I didn't play, play the guitar. Perfect. The last Saturday, right? Now, if you see, guys, Si ustedes se fijan, mm -hmm. All right? When you use did, there is no need for you to make the verb in simple past. Do you notice that? Because did, it transformed the, the verb to the past, right? Solamente si es positiva, el verbo va a ir en pasado simple. Si la oración es negativa, va a ir el did not plus the verb in the base form, ¿sí? Más el verbo en la forma base, all right? And that's it. Eso es todo, ¿sí? No, para la forma negativa es lo más sencillo, ¿sí? Porque no tienen que acordarse cuál es la forma pasada del verbo, right? Ahora, ¿sabes? Ahora que saben esto, que se recuerdan, porque ya sé que lo sabían, how will you make the first sentence con irregulares en negativo? ¿Saben cuál es el presente de Drew? Yeah. Which one it draw. is? Draw. Draw. This, that is correct. I did not. I did not. Yeah. Or didn't, como se gustan. Draw a landscape. Mm. Right? or any anything, right? Or cualquier cosa. That's why I did is an, a, an auxiliary, right? Because it helps to to make to make it easy, right? Or easier, right? That is correct. In this case, did works as an auxiliary verb, right? Because yeah. it transforms yeah. mm -hmm. uh -huh. and it helps, case, it helps to the verb. 
That's it correct. helps to the to the bird, right? That is correct. In this case, that's that's why it's called auxiliary, right? Because it comes mm -hmm. yeah. to the rescue <laughs> of the bird, uh -huh, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like and that. that's correct. And in that case, you don't need, you don't have. Actually, you don't have to transform the verb to the past. Or you right? must not, right? That is that is the word. Thank you, Dave. You must not when you use did. You must not transform the verb to the past. All right. En este caso, cuando utilizamos did, guys. No, así, pero no deben poner el verbo en pasado, ¿sí? Porque eso ya es gramaticalmente incorrecto. Porque el did lo que hace es transformarles la oración en pasado. Como dice Dave, es un auxiliar, viene al rescate del verbo y no lo tienen que poner en pasado, right Lo mismo pasa con la siguiente, la siguiente oración. I did not or didn't, como ustedes gusten, right Bye. Porque es el presente de bot. Who put us yesterday, right? And that's it. Cuando es pasado simple, por eso es que se llama pasado simple, right? Oops, but no voy a poner un Right? That's why it's simple past. Because it's the simplest of the past. You don't have to add anything else. No tenemos que agregar nada más. Porque, por ejemplo, si es negativo, se van a apoyar con el did not, con el did, porque el did lo que hace es convertirte el verbo en pasado. Por ende, no tienen que poner el verbo en pasado, sino que en su forma base, o como a veces le dicen, eh, forma base, infinitivo, uh, presente simple. ¿Sí? Por cualquiera de esos tres nombres lo van a escuchar. So, it can either be base form, infinitive, Simple present. Ah, present. Ah, en el caso de el pasado con el did. Right? Así lo van a escuchar al verbo. Así que si escuchan que el profesor mm -hmm. dice, uh, it's the verb in the base form, is the verb in the infinitive form, is the verb in the mm -hmm. simple present form, las tres cosas significan lo mismo. All right? So, so, so for you to know, right? Para que ustedes sepan. Base form, su forma base. Infinitive, en su forma infinitiva. To draw, to buy. Simple present, right? Draw, buy. Cualquiera de esos verbos, all right? Y si se fijan, funciona prácticamente igual que el regular verb, ¿o no? Lo único que cambia es de que o vamos a utilizar un verbo regular o vamos a utilizar un verbo irregular, all right? Para hacer preguntas, ¿se recuerdan? ¿Cómo hacemos preguntas? Did, did you play video games every Sunday? Perfect. Yes, right? I did. <laughs> awesome. So, vamos a ponerlo en verdecito. Right? Did you play video games? With that, with that happiness. <laughs> That's right. Teacher, right? how do you say gran oficio? Um, <laughs> gran tarea. <laughs> Uh, that's a that's a huge responsibility. <laughs> Una gran responsabilidad, right? Uh, so, did you play video games every Sunday, right? It works the same. Did, ¿cómo sería la otra? Uh, did you play the guitar the last Saturday? That's right. Did you play the guitar last, last. Saturday? Uh, did the guitar Oh, last. yes. The last, no. it's okay. Last Saturday or the last Saturday. Both are correct. Right. Both están correctos. Ahora, para las preguntas es todavía más sencillo. Y le voy a explicar una cosa para que no se confundan del inglés, al es, del español al inglés. Sorry. What happens in Spanish, guys? No sé si se han fijado, lo voy a decir rapidito en español. Cuando hacemos preguntas, no sé si se han fijado que hacemos las preguntas en negativo. No venden tamales uh -huh. por su casa. En español. <ríe> le dice sí. la señora. Ajá, y le dice la señora de los tamales. No, no tiene no tamales hoy. Uh -huh. <ríe> y Ajá. está incorrecto, ¿verdad? Right? Porque no, sí, exacto, tomar. no voy. <ríe> Ay, como que sí, exacto, no voy a querer tamales uh -huh. hoy. <ríe> right? No le pregunta. De una uh -huh. vez le dice que no, que no voy a querer tamales. Sí, obvio que no tiene. Ajá. A mí me enseñaron <ríe> eso en la U, pero igual siempre li como somos ya. Sí, se le escapa uno. Sí, entonces eso está incorrecto hasta en español, ¿sí? So, 
Como Yo creo no que saben. como somos salvadoreños siempre esperamos como que lo peor. <risa> <risa> no sé. O yo soy el enfermo, ¿verdad? No sé. No, tranqui. Es que honestamente sí. Right? Por eso es que hasta todas okay, las preguntas. You. You're welcome. Don't worry. Pero pongan, pong, les dejo tarea mañana. Escuchen cómo hacen las preguntas la gente. No espero una respuesta uh -huh. positiva, como dice Dave. Esperamos Ajá, honestamente lo Siempre no. esperamos lo peor. That's great. Ajá. Esperamos que nos digan que no. Well, I, espero que no tenga. Ajá. Entonces, es como que, right? No va a querer tamales. No va a querer tortillas. Le dicen a right? Pero en preguntas, aún en español, guys, no se hacen en negativo. ¿Sí? Si se fijan acá, porque estamos esperando un sí o un no. Y si le decimos yeah. solo que no, es que no. Right? Uh -huh. <ríe> right? Ay, no, qué barbaridad. Me hicieron reír. So, entonces, acuérdense, para preguntas nunca se utiliza el not. Right? Porque están esperando una respuesta de sí o no. So, did you play video games every Sunday? Did you play the guitar last Saturday? Igual esta, en re irregular. Right? Oh, antes de but, que me vaya. I, I, I have a question. Tell me. Uh, but in English, I think that that uh, we can use in that way. I think didn't you play the guitar last Saturday? Eso es correcto, verdad? Si no me equivoco. Didn't you play the guitar last Saturday? Fíjate que esa es otra forma conocida como. Ay, no recuerdo el nombre de esa regla gramatical. Uh, I, I, I Pero... think that is. Uh, I, Um, I forgot. <laughs> conditional. Conditional, creo que se llama. Pero uh -huh, funciona conditional. de manera diferente. Uh -huh. right? Esa ya es uh -huh. otra cosa que todavía no, no la han visto, pero funciona así. Did you play video games every Sunday, didn't you? Right? Es como que yo te pregunte, uh -huh. ¿vos solías jugar videojuegos uh -huh. solos todos los domingos o no? Uh -huh. Y didn't you uh -huh. at the end yeah. es como el o no, right? Oh, no. es... uh -huh. yeah. Yes, but right now, porque como estamos trabajando con oraciones simples, no estamos ocupando okay. eso. Uh -huh. okay. So no, ahorita lo vamos a dejar así. All right? Ok. Yes, That's para, right. no, para no enchivolarlos. Oh, no, 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 <laughs> yes. Lo siento, right. lo siento. Lo no, siento. no, para nada. Mejor que, si, que se quieran adelantar. All right? So, entonces, ah, sorry, otra vez se me olvidó. If you see, guys, como estamos ocupando el did, el verbo está o no está en su forma base o en el presente. Yep. That's correct. So, siempre que vean el did, el verbo va a ir en su forma presente o su forma base o en su forma infinitiva. All right? Just like that. And it happens the same with irregular verbs. All right? ¿Cómo entonces haríamos, viendo cómo tenemos el ejemplo acá, cómo haríamos la pregunta para la primera oración? Did you. Did you? Uh, did you uh -huh. draw draw a landscape? Awesome. Did you draw a landscape? That's it, right? How would it be yep. the second one? And the second one? Did you buy? Mm -hmm. Cosas? No, okay. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't buy pusa yet. Yeah, like okay. that. <laughs> All right, then. That, that's fine. All right, so that's correct. And the answer can be any of this, right? Y la al revés hicimos las respuestas, ¿verdad? Pero okay. las respuestas pueden ser cualquiera de las que están ahí arriba. Yo right. soy enamorada. <laughs> All right. No, no, no. All right, no, no. so. <laughs> so it can be any of this, the answer, all right? And that's it. Eso es todo, guys, con simple present. All right? Si se fijan, otra vez en presente el verbo Ma. para las preguntas. All right? Y como ya tenemos el did, ya base, no ponemos en pasado. Form. That's correct, and the base form. Okay? Y eso es todo, right? Ma. It works the same as the regular groups. Con los irregulares funciona igual que los regulares. ¿Se acuerdan Ma. todo lo que vimos ayer? Ah, que es para decir que una vez pasó, que pasó un montón de veces. 
uh, el go también y works the same. Funciona lo mismo. La única diferencia, guys, es que los irregulares son rebeldes y tienen su propio pasado simple. <ríe> All right? mm, yeah. Los irregulares son disciplinados, right? Todos tienen, terminan con ED. Pero no los irregulares, right? And that's the reason why I sent you a list on WhatsApp. All right? Por eso les mandé la listita al WhatsApp. So you, so you, whenever you have the time, go ahead and check it out. All right? So you can see all the verbs um, in simple, uh, in simple past for irregular verbs, right? Ahorita no le hagan caso a la tercera columna que son los participios. Okay. Right now, let's just focus on simple past, right? Ahorita solo enfoquémonos en el pasado simple. Do you feel now that is clear, guys? The difference? Yep. I mean, there is not much difference. The yes, only I difference? Did. Okay, awesome. Perfect, Astrid. Thank you, Dave. <laughs> So, and that's it, right? Háganlo lo más simple que puedan. Ahora, vamos a hacer la práctica, ¿sí? Para la práctica, solo vamos a utilizar un par de oraciones en un par de verbos, all right? Déjenme, ok, déjenme escogérselos, right? Vamos a utilizar... Se lo puede poner aquí y se lo puede poner en el chat también. Bites and bits. Dígame. What is the meaning? Shot. Sick, shot, shot. Can you spell it for me? S U C K. I I in in present S E E K. In past S O U G H T. Oh, okay. Sick. It's like um looking for. It's como buscar. I, I, I seek for happiness. Uh, like, like the series, like Seeking Woman. That's correct. It's Seeking Woman, uh -huh. right? Buscando una yeah. mujer, literalmente. Yeah. That's right. Yeah, Entonces, yeah. es buscar. Uh -huh. es, es buscar. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Yo le voy a dar okay. ahorita los verbos que me gustaría que practiquemos, porque son un montón. All right? So. Beats. Sí, que no sean muy conocidos. Oh, ok. Entonces, bueno, esos dos. No. Bites and Beats. Sí, está bien. Right. Ok. Um, vamos a ver. Otro que no nos hayamos escuchado mucho. Ah, vaya. ¿Ya han escuchado el de quemar? Burn. Burn. Ah, burn. Burn. Ajá. Y yes, el yes, pasado yes. simple de este es burnt. Right. Um, we see at the end, I right? my hand. No. Yes, that's correct. Yeah. You can have a burn uh, on your hand. That's correct. Yeah. Um, but be careful, be careful. <laughs> that's right, be careful. All right, one, two, three, four. Yeah, okay. yeah I know. It's an example. I know. I know. I know. Yes. All right. <laughs> Vamos a ver. Uno más, uno más. Oh, vayamos con este. Steal and stole. All right. Stole. Estos son los irregulares que me gustaría que practiquen. All right, lo vamos a poner aquí. ¿Cuáles son los regulares que quiero que practiquen? Um, vámonos con play. Uno fácil. All right. Vámonos con. Quiero ver qué otra les puedo poner. Melt. Which one? Melt. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Melt. Oops. Uh -huh. Yeah. Melt. And melt. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. Quiero ver. Another um, one could be. Um, hay tantos que no sé cuál decir. Ah, <laughs> uh, vaya. Um, Aquí estoy dream. viendo yo. Dream. Oh, dream. A oh, dream. Pero dream, yeah, dream is, uh, es irregular. Pero vámonos. Oh, yeah. Ajá, porque vamos a, a practicar 5 y 5. Develop. Vamos okay. con develop. Do you know what is uh, this? Develop. develop. Yep. All right. Develop. Uno, dos, tres. Ok, me faltan dos. Uh, oh, delay. Do you know what is delay? Delay. Yep. All right. 
Yes. But refresh my mind. Okay. Delay. Descri it's describe. <laughs> yes. Delay is when you are late, right? Cuando estamos, oh. cuando vamos tarde. Mm -hmm. so, uh, delay. Delay. Is uh, a uh, late. Sorry? Delay. Uh, late is tarde. That's correct. When you're late, But you are delayed. Delay. Es, uh, es llegar tarde o, o tardarse uh, con algo. For example, when the flight retrasarse. delays. Retrasarse. Uh -huh, retrasarse. Por ejemplo, los vuelos, uh -huh. ellos se retrasan, right? Uh, delayed Robot. flight. Uh -huh. Delayed flight. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. Right. And otra. A scratch. Ah, uh, it's scratch. What is the meaning? A scratch no. es, puede significar dos cosas. Rascarse mm -hmm. o mm -hmm. un raspón. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Entonces, uh -huh. estas días practiquemos ahorita. Right? Desarrollo, ¿verdad? Develop. Ah, that's correct. Y Scratch no, no es. Y Scratch no es. Um, comezón. Va que, ¿Verdad que sí? Es, sí. Es, si te pica, sí. Porque... <risa> yes. Okay. No, pero itch. Itch es, es comezón. Esta. Ah, itch. Itch. Itch, itch ah. es comezón. Scratch es rascarse. Ah. Uh -huh. O sea, Scratch de itch, right? No. That's correct. Yes, scratch okay. the edge. Yeah. <laughs> oh, han visto, han visto <laughs> los Simpsons, for, for example. El de los muñequitos que salen, it, se, se llama itchy and scratchy, right? Really? And, yes, Who? uno que salen en, en, en la televisión Teacher. dentro de los Simpsons. Yes, dígame. What is the meaning of stitch? Stitch. Oh, stitch. stitch es como... Um, Coser. Coser. That's correct. Una... Wow. Eh, ¿cómo puntada. Se cuando, puntada. Thank you very much. Ah, ¿Y qué tiene que ver con el muñequito azul? Bien raro, ¿verdad? Yes, ahí sí no sé. But... Porque el muñequito normalito ahí. <laughs> That's correct. A stitch, right? Pero eso significa una puntada. All right? Ah, so, puntada. No, puntada como de coser. Ajá, ajá, ajá. ajá. Mm -hmm. That's correct. De coser, pero no, no importa si es clothes es... o... Or... O oh, skin. That's correct. Ajá, Por ejemplo, si, si alguien se hiere, le dan um, stitches, right? Stitches, le hacen puntadas. Stitches. Uh -huh. uh, stitches. O como okay. la canción de Shawn Mendes, right? Stitches. Si le gusta uh -huh. la, la música. <ríe> all right. Uh, olvídenlo. A so, mí me gusta la música. <ríe> all right, then. Les recomiendo esa canción, muy bonita. So, quiero que trabajemos estas cinco irregular and these five that are, that are regular. What I want you to do is to make sentences, right? You can make a lot of sentences using only these, um, these 10 words. I'm gonna send them to the chat. These are regular. The chat. Uh, dígame. Melt, where is it? Uh, melt significa mm -hmm. derretirse. For example, mm. have you heard? Una persona, se puede. Yes, for a person, or it can be food. For example, the melted cheese. Como por ejemplo también eh, el queso derretido, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. It can be for both, right? Okay. Ahí está, ya se las copié al, al chat y se las voy a mandar también si ustedes quieren al WhatsApp. So, estas son las 10 horas, sorry, 10 verbos que quiero que me practiquen, all right? What I want you to do is to make sentences. Lo que pueden hacer para que les salga más fácil es hacer preguntas y responderles en positivo y negativo. Is that okay? That's clear. All right then, awesome. Ya se las copié ahí al chat y por cualquier cosa los voy a andar visitando en los grupos. All right? So, para que tengan tiempo, los voy a poner en, en trillos. All right? So you can work good. All right, so please accept the invitation and let's go practice, guys.
No, Astrid, can you accept the invitation? Ya se la envié, no sé si la puede ver. No, no me salió. Quizás porque me hice pequeña la pantalla, no sé. Ah, ok. Si gusta, pruebe otra vez. Pero, ¿cómo? ¿Tiene que mandarme a usted otra vez? No. Eh, no sé si le sale sección de grupos en la parte no. de abajo. Ahí le tendría que abajo. salirla. Ah, en la pantalla. No sé si ah, está en su ya, teléfono. Ah, ya, ya. Ok. Yes, yes. Ok. Ahora right, igual Pessy, no sé si le aparece la invitación. Jorge también. Igual. Igual. <coughs> My red. Hello. Hello. How are you? Okay. Thank you. I'm fine. Thanks. It was a good day. Um, okay, let's begin. <coughs> um, did you did you break? Did you break a uh, Did you break a plate? Yes or no? No. <clears throat> no? I didn't break a plate. Break. 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 Uh, what yes, is was it? It's gonna break. 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 B R A K and R E, right? B R uh, break. Like yes. the vehicle, vehicle, vehicle. The brake, break, right? To oh, stop the car, uh, right? Break. Like that. What do you mean a break? Break. I don't know. You say it first. Break. Uh, uh, okay. Break significa quebrar. Ah, break. Break. Ah, yo, yo pensé que me decía break. Que es como freno, freno. Ajá. Uh -huh. Yes, uh, break. Yeah, pero break is... Ajá, uh -huh. break are... is... is, is uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. B R E A T. Uh -huh. Yeah, like that. Break, break is, is break the, something. Right? It's a irregular verb because meaning a break. A it's broken. Broke. Break, break, broke, and broken. Broken and, and past participle, I think. Okay. Um, how do uh, did you break 
a glass eh, in, a, in a day? If I break what? If you have break uh, a glass. Ah. What's the time? What's the time? Break a uh, glass. If I break a glass, right? Glass, do you know what's meaning glass? Glass, yes, it's a water glass. Of glass to drink water or to drink yes, something yes. liquid. Okay. Water, uh, water, wine, coffee. Uh -huh, yeah. Okay. Beer. Beer. <laughs> mm -hmm, yeah, beer. Uh, for example, yeah, once I remember that I, I, I broke a glass um, because I think that I was yeah. I was uh, very very um, I don't know get uh, how do you say borracho I was too I I, I forgot it I forgot the bird drunk 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 uh, yeah get drunk right mm -hmm. got drunk oh yeah thank you did you drink coffee? Hello, Juan, Jorge. Hi, Jenny. Good night. Hi, hi. How are you doing? I'm fine. Awesome, Ben. What about you, Jorge? Are you working with one? A saber si él está aquí, ¿verdad? Hi, Jorge. Hello, Jorge. Yeah, I don't, I don't think he's here. Ok, Juan, I will move you to another group. Ok, lo voy a mover a otro grupo para que pueda practicar. Ok, thanks. All right, you're welcome. What's the, what's the main rule? Rule or the, the rules. U L reglas. Son las reglas. Las reglas. Ah. Uh, <laughs> okay. Ah, uh, yeah. Rosa, yeah, always. Always, always, always. Always, bro. Almost always. <laughs> almost always. Yeah. When yeah. I was in the school, uh, I used to do it. I used to do it. And like uh like uh everyone, I think. Okay. Uh, yeah. Burn. Have you have you ever have you ever broke the rules, bro? Rules. Son las. Oh, really? Rompe las reglas. Broken the rules. <laughs> have you ever? <laughs> have you ever broke the rules? Um, several times. <laughs> really? really? At a school, I think. Uh, at the school. Uh, to work. For example, one day tell you, don't use the phone when you are working. <laughs> ah, yeah. <laughs> and sometimes you are uh, uh, speaking a phone. Or you are uh -huh, yeah. The yeah. Phone. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, sometimes uh, no. we don't care and, and no do smoking. it because. Uh, no smoking I, at work or no smoking. Already, <laughs> uh, uh, you you can you can smoke at work at, at, at yeah. Anybody or work? Anybody only is an example. <laughs> oh, um, no, but yes, there are there are uh, uh, jobs that you can you have that freedom to do it. Yes, right. Yeah, for example, uh, when I was working in Happy, do you know what is Happy? There's this uh, internet. And so we had to, we had to go to the different towns and there we, 
we used to smoke, yeah, sometimes, but we have to be careful. We have to um, be be careful because of our, our bus was in the area close to us. Really? And suddenly they here appears and then, yeah, oh watch what we are doing. And he, yeah. and he uh, smell, smell the smoke. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, 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 in the air. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Okay, uh, how you burn? How you burn uh, your body uh, when you are cooking? Not a, yeah, cooking too. But I remember once when I, 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 my, my really? finger, this this finger, I was um, an okay. accident with a with a with a firecracker. And that is blow on my in my my hand. So we have a, a scare here. I don't know if you can see. Hey, yesterday, yeah. yesterday, uh, yesterday I burned my my hands. Really? My, yes, my wrist when I was in the oven in my out of my work. Okay. Can you, can you see? Can you see my hands? Yeah, I think. For here, for here. Uh, <laughs> wait, wait. Uh, a little bit, bro, but I believe you, I believe you. <laughs> yeah, okay. I trust on you, bro, I trust on you. <laughs> okay. And um, do you know what's Have you grown? ever grown? Grown? Yes, you know what's me, bro? Bro. Yes. Brother. Brother, uh, do uh, friend like uh, you are my -E friend. W. Grow. You know what meaning? Okay. You know what meaning? Grow. Oh, uh, grow. 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 Uh, grow. Spell. Grow. Okay. Yeah, grow. Grow is when you. The verb. Crecer, yes, right? yes, okay, okay, okay. You're right. Yeah. Yes. Uh -huh. uh, so uh, tell me your question. Okay. Where where did you grow? Donde crecí? Yes, when you when you were a child. Um first I remember that I was that I lived in Never. in the downtown. In the downtown. Downtown. And, yeah, in the downtown and then um we we went we we came yeah. to to here to there, be here yeah. several places yeah no uh, no no just just two or, or three i don't know years old for example uh, when i uh, my first my first ones mi primera vez creo que quiero decir ahí that i broken my heart yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, yeah, it's difficult that <laughs> moment. Yeah. And in the in the in, in the how do you say pasaba el tiempo? Uh, time passed. Time passed. Mm, uh -huh, time passed. Eh, uh, lo supera. <laughs> mm -hmm. Overcoming. No sé, I got over it. I, I think I go very, I think I go very. Overcome. Thanks, teacher. Ah, overcome. Overcome. Is it time overcome. I overcome. Uh -huh. Yes. Did you, did you steal, did you steal? My cell phone. <laughs> uh -huh, do you steal your cell phone? Yes, uh, um, the last uh, the last week <laughs> was. Yes, uh, it's uh, terrible. Is mm -hmm. <laughs> no sé cómo decir in, my, yeah. in my case, in twice, twice, twice told myself. It's correct, teacher. Yes. Uh, can you repeat again the question? Sorry. Did you did you did you steal your cell phone? 
steal, como robar. Ajá, te robaron, te robaron el teléfono. Y mi compañero ah. dijo, yes, the last weekend. Oh, ok. Um, sí, en ese caso sería... Did... Pero... Uh -huh. Did somebody steal your cell phone? Ajá, que si alguien le robó el teléfono sería ahí. Did... Ajá, pero... Uh -huh. Pero en mi caso yo le dije que, que a mí me lo habían robado dos veces. ¿Cómo sería? Twice. Two times. Uh, yes, twice or two times. Ambas, cualquiera ah, de las dos. Ok, okay. Mm -hmm. okay. In, my, in my case, I two twice mm, steal my cell phone. Still, stole my cell phone. Ajá, uh -huh. stole. stole. My cell phone. <laughs> But uh, nowadays, <laughs> I have two bad cell phones. Nah. <laughs> so, it's, it's a better, a better cell phone in yeah. this case. <laughs> <laughs> y Marcela solo se ríe con los emojis. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, Marcela. All right. <laughs> ah, did somebody still get cell phones? Uh -huh. But, para evitar decir you, ¿verdad? Did somebody still get cell phones? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Somebody's, did somebody still go? So, Marcela, did you delay? Hi. <laughs> yes. Did you did you delay at work? Yes or no? Como, perdón. <laughs> did you did you delay at work yesterday? Um, Llegó tarde, trabajo ayer. No. Se atrasó. No. Uh -huh. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. No, I didn't delay that work. Okay. No, I didn't delay, delay at work. At work. Okay, thank you. Okay. Um, Sería eh, delete como de, de borrar, entonces por eso no es de ti. Ah, delete. No, es delay. 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 Ajá. delay. Marcela, did you, did you yes. break her? <laughs> Something. Así sería. Some... You? In my case, yes. And you? <laughs> Can repeat the, the question? Did you break? Did you break? Heart? Some... Uh, did you can break? You, can you did write? You The sentence. Mm. How? <laughs> In the chat. Ah, great. Really, let me check. Espera, espera. Eso no se escucha bien. Okay. Did you. Did you pray? Listen to your heart. <laughs> My heart. Hey. Ahí está. When break. I say break, uh, when I say yes. break hard, uh, you, yes. can, you can uh, cry sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> In my case, every day. <laughs> yes. I cried a lot. When I remember the person. <laughs> yes, but I am a person very strong, strong. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> it's difficult, but it's overcome. Yes. Okay. Did you three times or algo así? Magita. Come. Three times. Yeah, three. Oh, times. Oh, in my case, in my case, a lot of time. <laughs> yes. Yeah. 
Pero pichu no sin vergüenza. Ay, perdón. <risa> Ey, aquí estoy también yo. Mentira, mentira. Yo. <risa> ok. I don't listen. <risa> okay, okay. Eh, did you. Did you. Bite. What is the meaning? Bite. Morder, bear. Bite. Mm, poco. Oh, no sé. Bite. Mm -hmm. Ah, morder, morder. Mm, yeah, yeah, yes. Okay. Uh, did you. Ah, okay, okay. Did you. Did you bite. Did you bite a, a dog? Si sí sería, dicha. Te mordió un perro. Ajá. Podría ser, quiero ver la pregunta, pero. Es que a mí me enoja porque a veces yo siento que la. Cuando respondo, respondo muy en español. ¿Será? Yes, pero eso es normal al principio. Don't worry. Okay. Uh -huh. Yes, ahí sería Did a dog beat you? Oh, Did a dog bite you? Perdón. <ríe> Yo solito uh -huh. les... <ríe> did a dog bite you? Yes. Si te mordió. Uh -huh. Bite. Uh -huh. Porque como el did ya hace pasada el, 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 el verbo, right? Uh -huh. Bite, beat es el pasado. Y yeah, así, beat me. Por ejemplo, sí me mordió. Yeah. No, no me mordió. Yes, I did, did. When I was a child, eh, a dog bites more, more times, muchas veces, much times. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yo me wow. seguían los perros y me daban miedo. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Where I mean, was you... a people in this case? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. oh. How do you say duele? <laughs> it hurts. Que duele. It hurts. It yes. hurts. It hurts yes. the bite of dog people. <laughs> yeah. In my case, the same. I was um, 19 years old and a dog, a dog bite my, in my arm. Sorry. The dog bites my arm. Yeah, it bit, for example, to myself, it bit my leg. And, mm -hmm. But I still like dogs. Para evitar decir en mi caso, myself. 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 Ah, baba. Es que mi feo voy a cuando digo en mi caso. Baba. Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> yes. No, pero ahí sería si usted está dando opinión uh -huh. de algo. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yes. All right, guys, let's okay. go back. Que ya es hora. Ya. Yes, ya es hora. Okay. All right, vamos, vamos. Okay. Hi, teacher. Hello. Hey, Amilcar. Hello. Oh, my God. The time is over very fast. <laughs> yes, it went fast today. <laughs> the good thing is that you were able to practice a bit, right? And I'm happy that now the, the topic is clear, right? Because that's the important thing, right? No, lo importante es que quede claro. No adelantar en los temas, right? So I'm happy that now it is clear. And guys, just a friendly reminder, remember that tomorrow we don't have class, right? Recuerden que mañana no hay, eh, no hay clase. Sería hoy eh, la última de esta semana y nos veríamos este lunes. All right? Do you have any questions, guys? Sienten que hoy sí ya está un poquito más claro. Eh, yeah. ¿sí but right. I need to talk a lot. Yes, we need to practice more. That's right. But yeah. we're going to okay. practice on Monday. Teacher, Dígame. Spanish. <laughs> okay. Sería como idea, y tal vez pienso, no se vea. Mm -hmm. Porque vaya, mi problema es que yo puedo entender, puedo hablar algo y todo, pero si me hacen preguntas, a veces me quedo, 
como yo hablo distinto como hablan las otras personas, pues no sé si tal vez es recomendarle que usted en algunas clases nos haga preguntas y por lo menos, o sea, saber responder más o menos. O si, y si hablamos o algo, usted nos corrige y nos diga, no, así no se dice, se dice tal, para ir aprendiendo también. Sure. Yes, we can do that on Monday. Podemos hacer eso el lunes si gusten. Uh -huh. De los temas que ya se vieron, hacer preguntas uh -huh. de eso mismo, right? Para que ustedes sepan. Uh -huh. Bueno, okay. haríamos el lunes entonces. Preguntas. Thank you. Me responderían. Yes. All right then. Entonces, muchas Pero gracias, no. guys. It's been I'm happy that no, I got no, to no, see no. you again. Dígame. Sí, 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 disculpe, solo una pregunta. Este, quería ver si después de este curso sería no. hasta en enero o sería continuo. Fíjese que mandé a preguntar porque todavía no sé. Me, me tienen en, en espera esa información. Por, por Yo digo que mañana en la mañana enviado. me lo haría. Dígame. Yo creo que es hasta el lunes, porque, ah, pero hasta el lunes, <ríe> hasta en January. Okay. Porque mi mamá también está aprendiendo y ella ya terminó el principiante uno y le han dicho que hasta en enero comienza el otro. Ah, ok. Pero igual, yo mandé a preguntar porque no sé. Sí, sí, sí. sí. Ajá, ah, entonces yo digo que mañana en la mañana me van a dar la respuesta. Uh -huh. Pero sí, yo sí, creería sí. también que hasta en, en enero. Pero igual, yo le voy a, yo le voy a decir que me dicen. Uh -huh. All right then. Yes, we're we're over the time. All right, guys. Thank you very much, and I hope to see you on Monday. Take care. Have a good so, uh, weekend. Next, next Monday. Take care. Thank you. You too. Okay, bye bye. Take bye care. bye. You Good too. Night. Bye. Thank you. Everybody. It was a pleasure. <laughs>